Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have a new arrival just before our game against Coventry City. And it's a former Coventry youngster, Cyrus Christie, is a Hull City player. Very, very good bit of business. We were in the market for a fullback. We've been out and we've got him. He spent time uh, with Birmingham in, in pre-season. He had offers abroad, but it was here in Hull that he decided to lay down his marker to say, I am here. Now, I'll, before I read the statement, because it isn't popping up yet, um, I'll take you through a little bit of his career. So, he's 29 years old, um, right back, Coventry born, but a Republic of Ireland international through his mother, who is of Lebanese and Irish ancestry. Uh, he's played 30 times for the Republic of Ireland, scoring two goals from right back. Uh, and being Coventry born, he went into the Coventry Academy, made his professional debut for them in 2010. And before he left Coventry in 2014 to join Derby, he made 119 appearances, scoring three goals and getting 13 assists, and had two loan spells in 2011. One at Hickley, one at Hinkley, sorry, and one at Nuneaton Town. Having left Coventry, it was Derby where he would really make his name in the Championship. He was there from 2014 to 2017, another 119 appearances under his belt, two goals, nine assists in a Derby team that was very, very good consistently year on year. He then joined Middlesbrough uh, for a season. 2017 to 2018, in 26 appearances he scored once for Borough and grabbed three assists. And then he joined Fulham in 2018, only just left Fulham, played 68 times, two goals, three assists, and had a loan in 2021 to Nottingham Forest where he played 44 times, didn't get any goals but got five assists. And then last season, for the second half of last season, he was out on loan at Swansea City and Russell Martin was keen to bring him back to, to, bring him back to Wales but he opted to come here instead, leaving his Swansea career on 23 appearances, three goals and five assists. Let's read the statement then, shall I? The 28 says, Hull City are delighted to announce the signing of attacking right-back Cyrus Christie on a free transfer. The 29-year-old has joined the Tigers on a two-year deal with the club holding the option of an extra year and has been allocated the number 33 shirt. So I thought that was Harry Woods. But does that mean Harry Woods is off on loan somewhere? Maybe. Or does it mean they've not allocated the youth team, the under-23s guys on pro deal squad numbers in the same way they have done in previous years? I think it's more likely to be the second one. Uh, beginning his career at Boyhood Club Coventry City, Christie is vastly experienced in the championship, making over 250 appearances in the second tier. And that's what we've done. By signing Cyrus Christie and signing Ryan Woods, we have brought in proven championship experience. Both of them playing over 250 times in this league. That's what this young squad, this excuse me, this squad new to the championship needs. A bit of championship know-how and a bit of championship leadership. We've got that in these two players. Uh, if then yeah, uh, uh, loans in confidence uh, 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 words making 119 appearances for Coventry City as well as spending time on loan at Conference North Sides Nuneaton Town and Hinkley United he joined Derby in 2014 on a three year deal claimed an assist on his debut made 119 appearances for them over three seasons before moving to Borough he featured 80 he's featured sorry 26 times for Borough over just six months scoring his only goal in a 1-1 draw against Fulham and then he moved to Fulham for an undisclosed fee he got promoted to them with the Premier League and uh, made 28 appearances in his debut season in England's top flight but he couldn't help them stay up made 30 appearances in all competitions the following season uh, which helped Fulham win promotion back to the top flight via the playoffs then he went on loan to Forest um, for the 2020-21 season and then in January 2022 he spent the rest of the season on loan at Swansea City and like I say 30 times for the Republic of Ireland um, and scored <clears throat> scored two goals 
And he scored his first international goal and his second cap, a 4 0 victory over Gibraltar in European qualifiers. And like I say, he is wearing the number 30 shirt. Interesting one, that one. Like I say, I thought it would have gone to. I thought that one was Harry Woods, locked down, sealed, confirmed, but not. Not to be. What a signing. I'm really pleased with that. Shrewd bit of business, free transfer. It's. It's a very, very good deal that we've done here. We did it with Figueredo, Championship Experience on a free. We've done it with Cyrus Christie as well. Then we brought in Woods. Seri on a free is a good deal because uh, he's got knowledge of the Championship as well. Then we bring it. Then we brought in players like Tufan, Sayad Manesh. Brilliant. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And there's still a couple more to go, of course. There's Demetrius Pelkas, which Baz Cooper reported this morning. Could still be done this week, but it won't be done in time for him to face um, for him to face Coventry. The deadline for the shut off of registration was midday today. Was when we announced Christie, so we know he can play tomorrow if Shotter Avaladze believes he is fit enough. And for Pelkas, I think that one will get done. Same with Hello Dervishol, who both deals are just a little bit complicated and are taking time. But, brilliant deal. And on that, I'll see you for the live preview tonight. Thank you for watching. Take care. Goodbye.